About 14 years ago, I invited the parents and relatives of my students to come in and talk about their experiences in the military. And we decided that because we are Navy Elementary, we should do something school-wide to honor our veterans. The day starts with a breakfast. We invite all of our veterans to come in with their children and enjoy a breakfast. And it's amazing to see generations, different generations, chatting with each other about their experiences. And then we invite our guests to go to the gym. And on the way, they are greeted and cheered on by the sixth graders who are in the hallway waving flags and cheering for them. Um, and then we start our first assembly and we'll sing the national anthem and the Pledge of Allegiance and the Armed Forces Medley. We'll hear from some sixth graders who will be reading essays about what Veterans Day means to them. My grandfathers and everyone else who was or are currently in the military play a very important role for our country. They protect and defend us from harm. They keep us safe in many different ways, such as on land, in the water, in the air, and on the coast, because there are five different branches which all have a different part in keeping our country safe followed by our guest speaker today, who is from Hero Dogs, which is an organization that uh, trains service dogs for veterans. It's incredibly important that we offer this experience, first of all, to say thank you to our veterans who put their lives on the line every day for us, uh, and to create a sense of patriotism in our country, and to be proud to be Americans, and to understand what it means to be an American and to support our troops. I hope the students come away today feeling thankful and grateful to be Americans, and when they see a service man or service woman, uh, they say thank you for their service and really appreciate how lucky we are to live in a country where our freedom is defended every day.